Welcome back now to a story that will have a lot of people in Pittsburgh talking trash. City Council members are implementing a new ordinance to reduce the amount of trash and litter in the city. But some neighbors think it's a bunch of garbage. Archie Lacasia Dele spoke with the council person behind the changes and explains what you'll need to do so you don't get fined. One of the things that can get you a citation, leaving your trash cans out too late. When these things are emptied, you'll have until 10 p.m. the day of collection to put these cans back. James Fogarty doesn't vibe with people putting out their trash way before it's collected. It creates like potential disease vectors all over our community. City Council passed an ordinance Tuesday that would allow a $35 fine for one trash violation. For a second within the calendar year of the first, it's 50 Three times, that's 100. This is the positive step in the right direction. You can get cited for accumulation of trash on your yard, improperly storing trash, and leaving cans for pickup before 6 p.m. the day before or after 10 p.m. the day of pickup. Also on that list, letting recyclables mix with other types of trash. I think we all kind of have to chip in to keep the city looking better and cleaner. Councilperson Bob Charlin introduced the bill. He says there's no new laws, but he says it fixes what was a drawn out process. We cite you, we have to view your citation or view your violation three separate times before we can actually uh, cite you. Charlin says the plans are to bolster the enforcers to help do that. He says adding anti-litter inspectors is in the works. We have three. We are budgeted to have 11 next year. We'll be able to actually um, proactively patrol and find these violations um, on our own. People like Nina Sacco say there are more pressing issues. A $100 fine for garbage at whatever time is left out, I don't think it should be the focus. But... Charlene says the focus should be on making Pittsburgh a place where people want to be. Neighborhoods that look like they're cared for get treated like they're cared for. Now there will be a phase in period. Councilperson Charlene says that during this time, people will get notices instead of tickets. The process is all supposed to start during the first quarter of next year. In Bloomfield, I'm Chile Casia in LA, KDK TV News.